to check mobility of his foot and ankle. There's a lot of things biomechanically that can affect the fit of a ski boot. Whether your arch is mobile or rigid, how much dorsiflexion you have in your ankle, all of those things can definitely affect the way that a boot fits your foot. Now that we've measured his foot for length and width, we've picked a boot off the wall that's going to match up and be comfortable fit for him. Once you get your foot in the boot, it's important to buckle up the upper cuff of the boot first, drawing your heel back in the boot and giving your toes some more room. Then stand up and flex that boot a couple of times. Now that we've picked out the right boot to fit the shape of his foot, to complete the overall fit, we're going to add a footbed to that boot. We'll talk about that in our next tip. I like the snow conditions, the grooming, uh, and the variety of trails. I've skied about 75% of the areas in New England, and this is about the one I prefer most of all. I'm Father Robert Heyman. I'm from Providence, Rhode Island, and I live up here during the winter. I've been coming to Sunday River since about 1983. Used to ski in Mount Washington Valley. But one winter when they had a snow drop there and good conditions here, I began driving over. And eventually friends of mine they got a condo down in Whitecap and been coming up every winter since then, since that time. I would think that Sunny River has about the best conditions of any area in New England. I like the first strikes, I come out early with the crowd. Morning and thank you for tuning in to Wake Up Sunday River. It is a beautiful snowy day here at the resort, and Eric and Nora are back rocking it. Oh, a little bit, a little bit more intense than we anticipated. Oh my gosh, don't you hate that when somebody gives you like a really strong handshake or too too high of a high five? Uh, anyways, uh, so thank you for tuning in this morning. We've got snow in the forecast, tons of great skiing and riding out there for you folks. Um, so be sure to stay tuned because we're going to give you a quick pick at the. Quick peek at the ski and weather report uh, in just a second here. We're going to be talking with Meg McDonald from Sunny River Communications, who's going to be walking us through all of the different pass options we have this year here at the resort uh, for the end of the season going into next season. Um, and then we're also going to be taking a chat with Norm McCormack, who's going to be telling us all about Sunny River Gems um, and all the products and great stuff that they've got going on down there on the access road. So be sure to stay tuned for that. Uh, so let's take a quick look at the ski and weather report, and we'll be right back after that. The report is brought to you by Sally Harkins and Company Real Estate. Find them at sundayriverhomes.com. Good morning, Sunday River. This is your trail report for Sunday, March 3rd. Today, we're going to be skiing, riding, snow boating, and monitoring 131 trails serviced by 15 lifts. Lifts will begin loading at 8 a.m. Most trails have been groomed out unless otherwise noted in this abbreviated report. For the most up-to-minute information on trail and lift status, log on to sunnyriver.com. Starting over on White Cap, the white heat tempest and a late opening moonstruck plot will be spinning. Shockwave remains ungroomed, and for glades, head to Starstruck Starwood, Hutzpah, and Hardball. And over to Lock Mountain, the luxurious triple will whisk you to the ungroomed naturals of Bim's Whim, Lockline, and Uppercut. Monday morning and T2 are closed for races. And over to Barker Mountain, the Barker Quad will bring you to the bumps of Agony, Top Gun, and Southpaw. For glades, hop into Last Tango. Don't forget to check out the Flow State Fortacross course. And going down on Southridge, the Southridge Quad Chondola and Sundance Surface Lift will be spinning. For beginner parts, head to Whoville and the Mini Pipe. And up on Spruce, the new and improved Spruce Triple will bring you to the hidden powder stashes of Upper Downdraft and the Glades of Narnia. 
And over to North Peak, a late opening North Peak plot will get you to the glades of Yetiville North for its northern exposure and enchanted forest. The jump line on T-72 is closed, but the gym park and 3D remain open. And out in Aurora, the Aurora Quad and Triple will be turning, Quantum Leap and Vortex were groomed, for glades head to Celestial and Supernova, and Black Hole remains ungroomed. And finally out to Oz and Jordan, the Jordan Quad double and a late opening Oz Quad will be spinning. Excalibur and Rogue Angel were given some extra love from the groomers last night, so those should be in fine shape today. Eureka and Emerald City are closed, but all other glades and naturals are open for your skiing and riding pleasure. Have fun, go with the flow, and we will see you out there. This weather report is brought to you by the Good Food Store. Shop is your year-round, full-service bicycle and backcountry ski shop. Featuring Alpine Touring and Telemark gear, Scarpa boots, bindings by Marker, Fricci, Rodafella, and 22 Designs, skis from Vocal and Solomon, top-of-the-line accessories to meet all your outdoor needs. In the repair shop, John will make sure your equipment is serviced and tuned to perfection. Need a new ride? We have bikes from Santa Cruz, Juliana, Scott, and Felt. We climb for the descent, making fitness fun. The Green Machine Bike Shop at 419 Main Street, Norway. We got the good do your school are about more than books and lectures? Are you somebody who likes hands-on learning and spending time outdoors? Do you wish school let you combine your passions? At Gould Academy, that's exactly what we do. Only six miles from Sunday River, Gould has a unique connection to the mountain and the natural world. Students find out who they are and what they love to learn. Many kids compete in our on-snow program. Some learn ski patrol or become coaches. So come to Gould for the mountain. And stay for everything else. From Sunday River, you'll find the Meeting House, a place for friends and family to come together. The menu offers wholesome and hearty fare made from carefully selected ingredients. Enjoy a quiet meal with family or join in the fray of the Viking Bar. The Meeting House is also available for private parties, so contact us today to book your event. Climb aboard for a comfortable winter tour to an extreme world above treeline. Powered by a custom four-track, all-wheel powered drivetrain, the nine-passenger Mount Washington snow coach transports guests into a treeless sub-arctic world at 4,200 feet for a truly unforgettable experience that anyone of any age can enjoy. Experience breathtaking views or Mount Washington's famous extreme weather. If you thought a summer drive on the historic Mount Washington auto road was amazing, you need to experience a winter tour on a Mount Washington snow coach. Good morning, everybody, and thank you for tuning in to Wake Up Sunday River. Uh, we have got some great entertainment for you folks today uh, and throughout the rest of the weekend and the season. So let's take a quick peek at what we've got going on around the resort. From the Primitive Craftsmith down on 111 Skiway Road, Newry, they have amazing furniture and decor um, and tons of great items for you guys to check out their full selection. So be sure to check them out in the Sally Harkins Real Estate Company building. Open at 11 a.m., we've got the Foggy Goggle here at the Southridge Base Lodge. We suggest that you try the Heats on Bloody Mary and all their other delicious cocktails on their menu. Um, they've got some great, great, great stuff to try out this year, including the Snowball, I believe, is my new favorite. You have to like creamy drinks, but it's very, very good, and it's not as heavy as you'd think it would be. Um, so I highly suggest you check out the Foggy Goggle this morning. Open at 11 a.m. We're doing kegs and eggs breakfast again down at Shipyard Brew House. That's going to be starting at 10 a.m. this morning. Uh, they've got a full bar down there, and for the first hour of breakfast, they're offering $5 Bloody Marys. Um, now, Jesse was kind enough to bring some on yesterday, and they are absolutely fantastic. Best Bloody Mary and the best value on the mountain, hands down. Uh, we've also got some happy hour specials down at Shipyard from 3 to 6 p.m. with half-price items and $4 Shipyard drafts. The Meeting House tonight, it's the place to be. Uh, it's the karaoke with DJ Peter G. Uh, now, I'm going to uh, put Nora on the spot here because I haven't asked her this question yet this season. Now, Nora. Yes. What song is your favorite song to do karaoke to? Tequila. Let's hear it. Da -da 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 -da. 
Oh, tequila. God. Wow. <laughs> I, I mean, I love the song, but like, you really like stretched all of your vocal cords on that one, didn't you? A lot of uh, really strenuous on that one. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Okay, let's keep going. <laughs> yeah. The meeting house tonight, uh, so that's going to be from 8 p.m. to close, and it's located right down on 23 Skiway Road in Newry, so be sure to check them out. They've got a great dinner menu and cocktail list there as well. Matterhorn Ski Bar, we've got live music tonight with Lucas Roy. Uh, Lucas Roy is going to be taking the stage from 5 to 8 p.m., so be sure to check it out. The Bethel Inn Resort is going to be having their taps and apps, which is available daily from 3 to 5 p.m. We suggest you try the mussels. They're fantastic. Um, and they've got a great lineup on their taps as well down in the tavern. Alrighty, let's do our favorite part of the show here, guys. We're going to do the too much fun morning after car count. Now, if you've never watched the show before, what we do is we go around to all of our favorite local watering holes and see how many of you had just a little bit too much fun last night uh, and decided to leave your cars at the bars. Uh, so let's see what we've got for a leaderboard from last night and for the season. Whoa, we had five people at the Matterhorn last night. We have broken 70 for the season, uh, so we're up to 73 cars at the Matterhorn, uh, 35 cars for the Meeting House. They are in last place, and Shipyard with one car last night brings them up to 38 cars, so I'm just giving them a little bit nose of a lead over the Meeting House. Um, so, wow, you, gotta, you guys really went after it last night at the Matterhorn. And I have to tell you, my car was not included in that count this morning. Uh, now, if you're looking to get around the resort and through Bethel Village, we highly suggest you take advantage of the Mountain Explorer. The Mountain Explorer is a free shuttle service that operates daily from 6 a.m. to 1 a.m. all season long. And for more information on the stops and the schedule, head on over to mountainexplorer.org. We are going to take a quick commercial break, and when we come back, we're going to be talking with Meg McDonald about all the pass options that you have to look forward to for next season. My name is Gage Berry and I'm from Nury, Maine and my favorite trail is T-72. Hi, my name is Adam and I'm from Bethel, Maine and my favorite trail is Wizard's Gage. Hi, my name is Zane Connolly, I'm from Bethel, Maine and my favorite trail is T-72. Hi, my name is Lewis Anderson and I live in Gilead, Maine and my favorite trail is 3D. And my favorite trail is 3D. My name is Harrison Connors. I'm from Bethel, Maine. My favorite, ah, oh, darn it. <laughs> my favorite trail is Northern Exposure. I'm Thomas LaPointe, and my favorite trail is Schutzpa, and I'm from Vermont. I'm Cyrus Mills. My favorite trail is White Heat. My name is Mason Perks, and I'm from Bethel, and my favorite trail is Grand Rapids. When buying a new home, working with an agent who knows the area is crucial. Cassie Mason, network manager of The Bean Group, is a lifetime resident of the Greater Sunday River area. She and her team offer personal, forward thinking, and top tier services from buying and selling to rentals and lending. Find the offices of Cassie Mason Real Estate on Route 2 in Bethel or visit us online at CassieMason.com. Family-friendly, good-time dining, and live entertainment. It's the greatest show off snow. From grocery to takeout, prepared meals to catering, specialty items, and more. The Good Food Store on Route 2 is Bethel's most unique grocer and catering company. Want to make it easy? Try our family-style prepared meals for tonight or for the freezer. We also have fantastic sandwiches and salads. Check Facebook for our daily lunch specials. 
thirsty, we have the best beverage selection in the area. We also have catering and in-home chef services for two to 200. The Good Food Store, where you can get all the good food and drink you need. My name is Jake Bracey. I'm 26 years old and I'm one of the co-owners of Yop Skis. So at Yop Skis, we hand tailor each pair of skis for each individual customer. YOPP stands for Yule Perkins Place. Uh, it's our great grandfather's wood shop on a farm that was built in 1717. And we brought the shop back to life and started building skis there. So at Yop Skis, we hand tailor each pair of skis for each individual customer. The bases and everything are all laid out. So you start with your base and your edges. And then we're just gonna build a big sandwich from there. So basically you're gonna add your fiberglass, add your wood core. Um, we use zone carbon fiber in our skis uh, to help dampen them out and give them stiffness in the right areas. Another layer of fiberglass. Uh, then you got your really pretty top sheet veneers. And we'll apply a graphic after that and then slide them in the press and just like baking a cake in 40 minutes, they're done. So my favorite ski is this Mountain Lion 106. And this was new for us last year. It's a pretty incredible shape. Um, it's got some early rise in the tip, and it's also a wider tip and a skinnier tail. So what you're gonna find is that if you get into powder, you're kind of crushing through trees or something, that tip's gonna ride up, tail's gonna sink down, and it's almost like water skiing for a little bit. And it can do everything. It can go fast, it can go slow, it can go easy or as hard as you want to push it. So that's, that's my everyday choice. So here at Yop Skis, not only do we customize our skis to fit your skiing style, but we also customize them to fit your personality. Uh, as you can see, everybody or future owner of each of these sets of skis has a little piece of them in the ski, and that can be as small as an idea or as big as you bringing a whole piece of artwork for us to use. If you'd like information on our skis or to see more examples of our work, head on over to yopskis.com. Good morning, folks, and thank you for tuning back into Wake Up Sunday River. Uh, we have got a great show lined up for you folks, and we are now joined by the incomparable Meg McDonald, who's going to be telling us all about the different Seasons Pass offerings we have to look forward to at the end of this season and to coming into next season. Thank you for joining us, Meg. Thanks for having me, Noah. So w everybody's talking about all these new Pass products and the added benefits. What are the ones that you want to touch base on as being, like, the biggest changes, the most important? So first off, we have our flash sale going on next week. So that's going to be March 4th to 10th, and something we're really looking forward to. It's the lowest prices of the season for the 2019-2020 season passes. Um, and new this, new this season, upcoming season, we've got the Nitro New England Pass, which is a really great option for those ages 6 to 29. And it's an opportunity to ski all three resorts in New England, um, Sunny River, Sugarloaf, and Loon. And they, um, they can ski seven days a week, and it only includes 12 blackout dates with some additional benefits as well. That's awesome. Now, mm -hmm. what's the price point of that pass, um, and what are the blackout dates um, for people who are interested in this pass? So that pass is going to be $349, and that's also available with our Easy Play Pay plan. So you can either put $50 down and pay over the course of four months, or you can pay in full and start using that pass starting March 11th, which is a great perk for those who love spring skiing. Definitely, definitely a great perk. Yeah, and then as um, as for our Black O'Date specifically, those are going to be during Christmas week. That's going to be December 26th to the 31st, and then additional dates in February for um, for President's Weekend as well. All right, good mm -hmm. to know. So if that's a, guys, that's a great deal mm -hmm. uh, for ages six to 29. So that encompasses sort of, you know, all of the junior and teen silver passes and also brings in that millennial and 20s pass that we've exactly. been offering. So exactly. that's an absolutely incredible deal. And mm -hmm. now we've also got a gold plus. Yes, we do. All right. So yeah. if you're a gold pass holder and you're just, you know, 
wanting to work into the upper echelons, what does it mean to have a gold plus pass? So if you're itching to get just get on the mountain a little bit more, our gold plus pass has early lifts on Sundays and select holidays. So, you know, for the 30 minutes prior to original lift openings, um, gold plus members can ski Sunday River out of Spruce and North Peak for, you know, 30 minutes before everyone else gets to touch that early morning corduroy. That's absolutely amazing. Mm -hmm. um, now, any other, you know, sales that we have going on throughout this next flash week, uh, this flash sale this next week, uh, what anything to focus on? Um, I think the big thing to focus on is the fact that our prices will be going up after the 10th. So if you would want to um, purchase a pass during your spring season, you have until the 30th of April as well to get those lower prices in general. But again, our flash sale is the best time to get the best prices for the 2019-2020 season. All right, good to mm -hmm. know. So people have, you know, basically this week, Monday through Friday to get it done. Definitely encourage people to, to buy their passes this week. Get out there, guys. Get down to the season's pass desk. Call us or head over online um, and get all that set up so you're good to go for the next season. Yeah. All right. Awesome. Anything else you'd like to touch on today, Meg? I think that's about it. All right. Well, thank awesome. you for joining us. Thanks for having me, Noah. All righty. We are going to be taking a quick commercial break, and we'll be right back after this. This is your Sunday River Real Estate Featured Property. Built in 1987, Brookside is the largest slopeside complex at Sunday River with studio, one, and two bedroom units. The larger units offer two bedrooms, one bath, and an open living area with a gas fireplace. The Brookside Complex also offers a separate recreation building with an owner's room, a common room with a large fireplace, access to the outdoor heated pool, a hot tub, sauna, and locker rooms. For more information on Brookside Condominiums, come visit your official agents at Sunday River or online at sundayriverliving.com. Come to the mountains of Sunday River, the lakes and rivers of Western Maine, and the village of Bethel. Finding your happy place is easy here and something we've been helping people do for over 20 years. Sunday River Real Estate serves the greater Bethel community and is the official real estate agency of Sunday River Ski Resort, working with buyers and sellers of all types of property across the region. Whether you're looking for a slopeside condominium, a village home, a new chalet, or the perfect piece of land to build on, we're here to help you make this place your home. Come visit us at our office in Southridge Base Lodge. Come visit the Main Mineral and Gem Museum. Our preview gallery and store are open so you can dig in to some of Maine's finest treasure. In our preview gallery and store, you'll find the finest locally mined and crafted gemstone jewelry, handcrafted items for the home, educational books, and toys for the whole family. For more information on the Main Mineral and Gem Museum, visit us on Main Street in downtown Bethel or online at mainmineralmuseum.org. It's in the same location, but now it's Butcher Burger, and you can get all kinds of awesome food there. Burgers, chicken sandwiches, and cut fries, and all the brews they have there are made in Maine. Let's go get a Butcher Burger.
Good morning, and thank you for tuning back in to Wake Up Sunday River. We've got Eric and Nora back there taking their mid-morning nap. Uh, oh, yes, you know, anything shy of two cups of coffee, and they would go right back to sleep. Uh, now, we've got tons of great events going on around the resort this weekend um, and heading into the week, so let's take a quick look um, at what's to come. So first of all, we want to wish you a national happy What If Cats and Dogs Had Opposable Thumbs Day. Um, I'm not sure this holiday ever needed to exist or needs to exist in the future, but let's celebrate. Um, and that is a terrifying photo. It looks like the cat in the hat. It literally does. The cat in the hat with opposable thumbs. I'm also not a cat guy, so I don't know. Maybe if dogs had opposable thumbs, that'd be better. I like dogs. All right. Let's keep going. <laughs> Learn to Ski and Snowboard Weekend. We've got a Become a Skier or a Snowboarder with the Sunny River Snow Sports School. Uh, we've got packages that include lesson options, uh, rental packages, lodging specials, opera parties, and more. Um, the first weekend being this weekend, the first or the third. Uh, you can do a one-day lesson or a two-day lesson uh, for $59 or for $139. You can book today by calling 824-5959. The Camp No Limits Foundation has partnered up with Maine Adaptive, and they are hosting their 10th annual camp here, which is educating and empowering and supporting individuals with limb difference since 2004. Um, this is happening all weekend long. Um, and for more information on the different events that are going on, how you can participate and how you can um, donate, head on over to nolimitsfoundation.org or maineadaptive.org. We've got the new Nitro New England Pass we were just talking about with Meg McDonald here. Um, it's a special seven-day flash sale that we have going on from the 4th to the 10th um, where you can lock in discounted rates for just $50 and pay over the summer or you can pay in full and start using for the rest of the season starting on March 11th. Um, great deal, $349 for kids ages 6 to 29. Yes, kids can be up to 29 years old. Um, so be sure to check it out before prices go up. You get all three resorts, Sunday River, Sugarloaf, and Loon. Um, so an incredible deal to be had there for sure. We've got tons of great cross-country skiing here in Bethel, Maine right now. Bethel Village Trails at the Bethel Inn Resort is open from 8.30 a.m. to 3 p.m. with cross-country skiing, snowshoeing, and fat tire biking. They've got a 40-kilometer trail system and some stellar terrain right now. Uh, Carter's Cross Country off of the Intervale Road in Bethel is open from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. And they've got 55 kilometers of beginner to expert terrain with rentals available on skis and snowshoes. The Mount Washington Auto Road has their Trails Total Ticket. Um, it's an all-day pass that includes the snow coach, cross country skiing, and tubing. Adults are just $69 and juniors are just $49. Uh, call for availability now or head on over to the MountWashingtonAutoRoad.com. Now, the Coffee Hound Coffee Bar has their two locations again this season, their flagship being at Southridge Base Lodge, which is open daily from 8.30 a.m. to 3.30 p.m. They've got specialty coffee drinks and their mini donuts. Uh, in their Whitecap location, they are open on Saturday from 8 to 4 and Sunday from 9 to 4, um, and they've got a great selection of pastries, um, crepes, and our personal favorite, the Fondue German Sausage Sandwich. Um, so be sure to check out both locations. Um, Whitecap just located just upstairs from the Shipyard Brew House. Now Sunday River Sports is having their annual sale and offering 30% off all parkas and pants uh, and 30% off serious gloves and 30% off footwear as well. This excludes ski boots, socking, and footbeds, um, but be sure to stop on by Southridge Shop to see their full selection now. Now, Sportoma is also offering 30% off all outerwear uh, and an additional 20% off helmets and goggles. Most skis and snowboards are 20% off, and they're offering 40% off their GS race suit. So if you have a, any growing kids who are going to be needing a GS race suit next season, be sure to head on over to Sportoma because those don't go on sale very often, and that's a great deal. Sportoma is located right on Route 2 in Bethel, so as you're heading back towards Route 26, it'll be right on the right-hand side of the road. The Green Machine Bike Shop located right on Main Street in Norway, Maine, is offering 40% off all Smith helmets and goggles. Um, so be sure to head on over and check that out. It's a great deal to be had. Alrighty, now uh, we're going to take a quick look at the ski and weather report. And when we come back, I'm going to have the opportunity to talk with quite possibly Western Maine's most interesting woman, 
ever. Uh, Nora McCormack, and she's going to be talking all about the Sunny River Gem Shop down here on the Access Road, um, so be sure to stay tuned for that. The report is brought to you by Sally Harkins and Company Real Estate. Find them at sunnyriverhomes.com. Good morning, Sunday River. This is your trail report for Sunday, March 3rd. Today, we're going to be skiing, riding, snow boating, and monitoring 131 trails serviced by 15 lifts. Lifts will begin loading at 8 a.m. Most trails have been groomed out unless otherwise noted in this abbreviated report. For the most up-to-minute information on trail and lift status, log on to sunnyriver.com. Starting over on White Cap, the white heat tempest and a late opening moonstruck plot will be spinning. Shockwave remains ungroomed, and for glades, head to starstruck starwood, chutzpah, and hardball. And over to Lock Mountain, the luxurious triple will whisk you to the ungroomed naturals of Pim's Wim, Lock Line, and Uppercut. Monday morning and T2 are closed for races. And over to Barker Mountain, the Barker Quad will bring you to the bumps of Agony, Top Gun, and Southpaw. For Glades, hop into Last Tango. Don't forget to check out the Flow State Fortacross course. And going down on Southward to Southwich Quad, Chondola, and Sundance Surface, lift will be spinning. For beginner parts, head to Whoville and the Mini Pipe. And up on Spruce, the new and improved Spruce Triple will bring you to the hidden powder stashes of Upper Downdraft and the Glades of Narnia. And over to North Peak, a late opening North Peak plot will get you to the Glades of Yetiville, Northwoods, Northern Exposure, and Enchanted Forest. The jump line on T-72 is closed, but the gym park and 3D remain open. And out in Aurora, the Aurora Quad and Triple will be turning. Quantum Leap and Vortex were groomed. For Glades, head to Celestial and Supernova, and Black Hole remains ungroomed. And finally out to Oz and Jordan, the Jordan Quad double and a late opening Oz Quad will be spinning. Excalibur and Rogue Angel were given some extra love from the groomers last night, so those should be in fine shape today. Eureka and Emerald City are closed, but all other glades and naturals are open for your skiing and riding pleasure. Have fun, go with the flow, and we will see you out there. This weather report is brought to you by the Good Food Store. for helping people. It's what we've done best for over 25 years. And we are Sally Harkins and Company Real Estate. We strive to provide the best service possible. Buying or selling is a very personal experience. We go above and beyond to meet our clients' expectations. We met Sally when we were looking for a home in Maine. Stacy showed us our home that we bought. She made the whole process really easy and seamless. We love our home. Come by and see us at 111 Skiway Road. From beers and bloodies to apps and entrees, no ski day is complete without a stop at the Foggy Goggle. Our menu ranges from wings and rings to chili and chowder, lobster rolls, burgers, and of course our famous nachos voted Best of Bethel three years running. The Foggy Goggle was voted Best Opera Ski Bar too, so grab a beer on the deck, catch some sun, and check out the nightlife. We're home of the Bud Light Music Series with Opera Entertainment Fridays and Saturdays. The Foggy Goggle, located slopeside in the South Ridge Lodge. Cilantro, another great food offering at Sunday River, located in the food court at Southridge on the second floor. Selection, service, and convenience, all at Sunday River Sports. Skis, snowboards, boots, helmets, goggles, soft goods, and more, all at unbeatable prices. Buy your boots from us and one of our experienced technicians fit them to you for free. We demo every ski on our wall, so test unlimited skis with sloped side convenience. Stop on by our main location at South Ridge Base Lodge. Sunny River Sports, on mountain convenience with off mountain pricing. All right, everybody, welcome to Sunday River's Pond of Palooza here.
family owned and operated, Sunday River Gems has been a part of the Bethel community for over 25 years. Collectors and gift seekers alike have enjoyed an assortment of locally mined minerals, handcrafted tourmaline pieces, and specimens from around the world. Keeping quality affordable to visitors and locals is something to take great pride in. To those who have supported and grown with us over the years, thank you. Sunday River Gems, it's not just a shop, it's tradition. Good morning, and thank you for tuning back into Wake Up Sunday River. I'm now joined by Nora McCormack, who's going to be talking to us all about Sunday River gems down on the Access I'm Road. I'm slinging rocks already. Oh my goodness, I didn't even catch it. Oh, that must uh, be a powerful one. It, oh, it is. Can you <laughs> feel... Oh my God, I feel the resurgence of life. Oh mm, my goodness. Right? All right, now, uh, tell us a little bit more about the rocks that you've brought in here for us, and um, about the different gems and, you know, full product variety down at the Sunday River Gem Shop. Well... I'm glad you asked, Noah. Did you even ask anything? I just wanted to say that. I, I've had like <laughs> I'm nine pretty cups sure of I, coffee I'm this pretty morning. sure I asked a question. I don't remember which question, yeah. but well, let's roll uh, with it. Well, first off, Sunday River Gems. Uh, it's right on the access road. It's that little red building on the right-hand side, right when you get into Newry. Um, there is a whole line of locally mined tourmaline jewelry pieces, local amethyst, um, and we've got just the whole gamut of of gems for jewelry and for mineral collecting. Um, so this is a quartz crystal that I stole off of the desk of someone directly across the hall from you because they've come in and are all know, gem sphered out. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. But um, it's there is such a, a huge selection down there, for, and you know every price range from twenty five cents to you know you can purchase a larger big honkin amethyst piece i think that's the technical term is honkin um you know and those range up to like you know 400 500 but basically you can go in there with what do we say on uh, vacation week a, a bag full of or a, a fistful of quarters full of change and just slap what? it down on the counter and charlie will be able to, to hook you up with with a oh. whole variety of tumbled stones or local um you know raw tourmaline yes. amethyst pieces rose quartz and all that jazz and that's amazing so you've talked about a little bit about the um you know the retrograde that we're in or yeah. whatever current state the state of the nation the state yeah. of the, the world now um now what is the stone that you suggest um well let me pull up my, my <laughs> oh Google, i thought my i Google thought we were prepared here. to tell people well no um <laughs> right now i know right i, I pretend i fooled you that i know exactly i thought it was like I, okay so nora sold me this telling me <laughs> and she, the way she like set it up i thought she was an actual expert fake it till you make fake it fake it till you make it okay so That's so the sunday river tv way it really is <laughs> now you so in addition to some great stones and minerals and elements and whatnot that you have down there i know that you also have some great art pieces we do. Well, this, oh, look at that. See, look at all those rings. Aren't that? Exactly. Look at that fine jewelry. Right? Understated, really, when you wear them all together. That red piece, that's still in there. That's a, that's a red jasper piece. And it's, if nobody buys it soon, that is going to live on my finger. Um, but we've got the, some green amethyst, uh, turquoise, labradorite. I mean, and, and speaking of labradorite, Labradorite right now with whatever astrological cycle we are in right now, um, there are three stones that are supposed to be at their peak performance now basically through the end of the month and Labradorite is one of them. And uh, for all of you, you hippy dippies like myself that I just, I love this stuff. Uh, right now, Labradorite will help you guide your empathy, grow your intuition and ground your spirit. I feel like you need spirit grounding. Just. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, clip my wings, Nora. I'm ready to be grounded. Absolutely. And Amber, Amber right now is in peak performance, okay. and that um, is the stone of photosynthesis. So if you got a plant that's dying, like all of your plants at your place, just pop a little piece of amber in there, and that should uh, help them get the nutrients that they need. It also nurtures your inner child, shines light in, and radiates light out, whatever that may mean. <laughs> and then garnet also. I do have, I have many pieces of garnet next to my bed, you know, oh, um, all that. <laughs> Eric's laughing yeah, at me. Tell me, what, there, does this, right what, does, what does garment clean, clear up? Like, what is um, that? The multifacets increase your perspective and motivate your ideas into action. So I am a giant uh, 
I'm on a self-help journey with manifestation and all that jazz and um, multi and it, um, like uh, abundance crystals. We have plenty of those at Sunday River Gems, which is, um, you know, this is just uh, this quartz has just a couple points, but we have some pieces that have, you know, hundreds and hundreds of, of points. And those types of stones are supposed to help bring your dreams to fruition and help you manifest what you what you would like and abundance and all of that stuff which i i'm i'm totally sold on that i bought a giant citrine piece last week and well abundance. when you said a big honkin and i was like honkin. i know exactly you the know one what that... i mean right yes yeah i didn't post it i didn't bring in any pictures of it but i assure you it is magnificent uh but citrine also is a stone that is supposed to help with with help you get abundance in your life and manifestation and all that all that fun stuff so that's very good yeah now, right? <laughs> now in addition to you know um the rings and whatnot there was other art that i know you wanted to discuss wow, oh my look at what whoa we have what here. do we have here i didn't know you had that well now, isn't this just listen i feel like i should be burning sage right now and like yes you know and Eric's laughing back there. You again. definitely belong in like the desert. <laughs> oh, wait, oh right. yes. Look at that. Our, I'm trying to keep it away from the microphones because that just must not sound awesome at the Summit Hotel. Sorry, guys. Now, can uh, you tell me <laughs> what is this exact? I know it's a mobile or wind chime of some yeah. sort, stuff, but what, are, what do we have here for stones? These are agate slices, and uh, agate can be dyed, and this is a lovely pink variety. Mm. But at, down at the shop, we also have blue and a natural um, the Ooh, brown tone. Okay. Um, so, and I believe there might be some purple out back, but um, we've got a bunch of these, and that it's, I think they're 20 bucks. And it just sounds lovely. And it's a, agate is a, it's fairly durable. You know, it, you can have this outside and. That's uh, gorgeous. This yeah. one, I, I think this one looks like the state of Maine right here, but I love it. All right. Well, thank you for bringing on all this uh, great stuff and sharing your knowledge with us here. Well, did you notice this beautiful selenite lamp that's behind you, Noah? You know, I love selenite. I know you did. You came in and bought some, didn't you? I did. Oh, hold on. Shh. Get off my finger. Ugh. Oh, got a little little anxiety there. Okay. I'm just going to be wearing it forever. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Buckle up, guys. Buckle up. Now, we've got this selenite lamp back here. Now, they also have selenite, um, what would you say that is? They're like, like points a, like and, a, and um, like bars yeah, of it as yeah, well. Yeah, but I have the one that you put the candle in, like the tea light. What oh, do you yeah, call the that? Oh, yeah, the candle holder. The candle holder. <laughs> Yes. Uh, you need more. You need to get on my level. With I, do, I do. I yeah. do. You are just in rarefied form Ooh. right now. <laughs> but uh, but yes, the selenite. Now, so what is the um, what's the property of selenite? What does it do that like people? Um, that uh, some people say that. What was that, Southern brother? It filters the air. It filters the air. Selenite does. Okay. Yeah. Um, it can also help you let go of negative energy and let, you know, it helps with that. Mm. So I have approximately 57 of these lamps at home and I feel great. Well, that is just amazing. And um, I'm so <laughs> glad that all this has worked for you and that you are so normal um, <laughs> because, you know, it's really a testament to, uh, to the power of the gems here. Yeah. Well, thank you for joining us this morning. Hold, and also, when you go in, yes, don't pick the gems. Let the gems choose you. <laughs> On that note, thank you for joining us, oh. Nora, this morning. <laughs> You're welcome. We will be right back after this quick commercial break. <laughs> Come find us this winter at the Bethel Inn Resort. Make it an evening and enjoy comfortable fine or casual tavern dining. It's all here at our classic New England resort in the heart of Bethel. Come find us this winter at the Bethel Inn Resort. Come for dinner, stay late for cocktails and live music. Local musicians like Denny Bro and Chad Porter, plus bands like Pete Kilpatrick and Moon Boot Lover. It's all here at our classic New England resort in the heart of Bethel. Perched at the top of Powder Ridge, facing the Sunday River Ski Resort and overlooking the Mahusik Mountain Range, Ski Esta is the ideal base from which to build your family vacation memories. 
Our multi-million dollar home has spacious and well-appointed living and dining areas, a chef's dream kitchen, superb recreation room, beautifully decorated bedrooms with ensuite bathrooms, fireplaces, and all the resort quality amenities you could ever imagine, including an indoor heated pool, sauna, steam rooms, home theater room, a mud room complete with dog shower and 14 pair boot dryer, a rooftop deck, fire pit, and outdoor hot tubs. Whether you are here to ski, golf, fish, hike, bike, ride snowmobiles or ATVs, or enjoy any other year-round activity the area has to offer, this amazing vacation rental home is the perfect place from which to do it. Contact us today to book your unforgettable vacation. Coffee Hound, they have the best hot chocolate, the best coffee after a great day of skiing to warm up. It's just a great experience, it's more than coffee. After a cold day skiing, my favorite thing is hot chocolate. Hot chocolate and mini donuts from the Coffee Hound. The mini donuts are some of the best mini donuts that I've ever had. Welcome to Sportoma, a family-owned shop steeped in Sunday River tradition. Whether you need a tune on your skis, help with a boot fit, or replace an old worn-out jacket, Sportoma is one-stop shop for all your outdoor needs in all seasons and all conditions. Let our demo and rental center help you on your next adventure, whether it's downhill or cross-country skiing, snowshoeing, or snowboarding. For brands that you know from people that you trust, visit us at Sportoma on Route 2 in Bethel, or check us out online at sportomamaine.com. Good morning and thank you for coming back. We're all zenned out here at Sunday River TV because we've had our our gem time this morning. Um, let's take some deep breaths and alms. Let me hear your um. um I have my prosperity, um, all that good stuff dialed in. All right, folks. Uh, so thank you for tuning back in to Wake Up Sunday River. Uh, we are all centered um, and in our chakras and all that good stuff. I just made all that up, so don't take that seriously. Uh, now, we've got tons of great events coming up this season. Um, so let's take a quick look at what you have to look forward to. Gosling's Rum is going to be back for a dinner party um, on March 9th at 7 p.m. It's $69 per person. Um, and it's going to be hosted at Slider's Restaurant at the Jordan Hotel. Um, it is going to be a dinner that is paired with different Gosling's rum-inspired cocktails. Um, and it's going to be a four-course meal um, that is a New England-style themed dinner. Um, so be sure to check this one out and get your reservations in early. For more information on the full menu and pairings, head on over to sundayriver.com slash events. Red Bull is going to be the, doing the slide-in tour on Wednesday, March 13th. Watch out because an RV of pro snowboarders is rolling in. Uh, you can join these pros all day for jam sessions on T72. There's going to be Zeb Powell, Jesse Augustin, and Dennis Bonus, uh, Leon TV. Um, and they're going to be doing an après ski party on the Foggy Goggle from 3 to 6 p.m. on Wednesday, March 13th. We're going to be having the BMW Winter X-Drive event here at the resort March 15th through the 17th from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. Um, you're going to get the opportunity to join the BMW Winter Experience team um, and see the power of these vehicles that they have in their full product line. Uh, it's a great event and an opportunity to drive some of the best-in-class vehicles um, through some of our wintry conditions up here and see how they perform. So for more information on that, head on over to sundayriver.com events. Um, and make sure to be here for the full uh, event on uh, Southridge Base Lodge, the 15th to the 17th. The main adaptive ski-a-thon is coming back again this year, and it's going to be happening Saturday, March 23rd. So this is your chance to help main adaptive reach their fundraising goal for 2019. Um, in addition to being, excellent, being an excellent fundraiser, it is a ton of fun. Um, you can join as a member, a sponsor, or just an individual who wants to provide pledges to an existing team. Uh, for more information on that, you can head to our website slash events or mainadaptive.org. The World Pro Ski Tour is going to make banking its stop here at Sunday River, March 29th through the 30th, where you can register today. The World Pro Ski Tour is the most exciting dual alpine race of the season. 
It's going to include Olympic, World Cup, and NCAA competitors. Alpine athletes do need to be 18 plus and register at worldproskitour.com. We are going to take a quick commercial break, folks, with your last uh, your last look at the weather here. And when we come back, we are going to be doing a watch and win with your opportunity to win a Matterhorn gift certificate and a Coffee Hound gift card. So this is a good one today. So you're going to want to get your phones ready. All right. We'll be right back after this. Ski Report is brought to you by Sally Harkins and Company Real Estate. Find them at SundayRiverHomes.com. Good morning, Sunday River. This is your trail report for Sunday, March 3rd. Today, we're going to be skiing, riding, snow boating, and monitoring on 131 trails serviced by 15 lifts. Lifts will begin loading at 8 a.m. Most trails have been groomed out unless otherwise noted in this abbreviated report. For the most up-to-minute information on trail and lift status, log on to sunnyriver.com. Starting over on White Cap, the white heat tempest and a late opening moonstruck plot will be spinning. Shockwave remains ungroomed, and for glades, head to starstruck starwood, chutzpah, and hardball. And over to Lock Mountain, the luxurious triple will whisk you to the ungroomed naturals of Bims Wim, Lockline, and Uppercut. Monday morning and T2 are closed for races. And over to Barker Mountain, the Barker Quad will bring you to the bumps of Agony, Top Gun, and Southpaw. For Glades, hop into Last Tango. Don't forget to check out the Flow State Fortacross course. And going down on Southward to Southward Quad, Chondola, and Sundance Surface, lift will be spinning. For beginner parks, head to Whoville and the Mini Pipe. And up on Spruce, the new and improved Spruce Triple will bring you to the hidden powder stashes of Upper Downdraft and the Glades of Narnia. And over to North Peak, a late opening North Peak quad will get you to the Glades of Yetiville, Northwoods, Northern Exposure, and Enchanted Forest. The jump line on T72 is closed, but the gym park and 3D remain open. And out in Aurora, the Aurora Quad and Triple will be turning. Quantum Leap and Vortex were groomed. For Glades, head to Celestial and Supernova, and Black Hole remains ungroomed. And finally out to Oz and Jordan, the Jordan Quad double and a late opening Oz Quad will be spinning. Excalibur and Rogue Angel were given some extra love from the groomers last night, so those should be in fine shape today. Eureka and Emerald City are closed, but all other glades and naturals are open for your skiing and riding pleasure. Have fun, go with the flow, and we will see you out there. This weather report is brought to you by the Good Food Store. Hi, my name's Dave. I'm the owner of Smoke a Good Barbecue. We're the Little Orange Trailer right here on Route 2 in Bethel, Maine. We do honest to goodness barbecue. Smoke to perfection over a low wood fire. Everything's straight up, no frills. Come on down, give us a visit. When they were diagnosed in 2009, we thought, well, okay, there's one more thing on the list that we won't be doing, but we found Maine Adaptive, and we've been skiing. This is our seventh year, so we've been able to ski together as a family, so it's been great. It's been very special to have you guys and get to see the kids grow up and ski as a family is just an amazing, amazing thing. So calming to come back into this music. Look, I mean, Nora's just swaying to the beat. Oh, look at this interpretive dancing. Oh, Napoleon Dynamite has nothing on you, Nora. Look at that. 
Thank you for tuning back in, guys, to Wake Up Sunday River. Now comes our favorite part of the show here, second only to the Too Much Fun Morning After Car Count, when we get to give back to all you guys with some great gift certificates uh, in exchange for the winning trivia questions for today's Watch and Win. So let's see what our question is today, guys. What is the world record for toes on a cat? This is quite, quite arguably the weirdest question we've ever asked you. 16 toes, 4 on each foot, 28 toes, 7 on each foot, 20 toes, 5 on each foot, T, 32 toes, 8 on each foot. All right. I think that is just a 32. That's not a T32. It's not a ski trail. Uh, now, let's see. If you know the answer to ha what is the maximum number of toes on a cat ever, watch and win. Call now, 824-5007. It's comforting to know that nobody knows this off the top of their head because you either are really into cats or really into toes, which either are pretty weird. So it's good that they're taking your time oh, to... You're still, your phone's off the hook. Oh. Mine is? Yeah. Can we fix it? <laughs> you Are you guys messing with me? Good morning, caller. Do you have an answer to today's question? Good morning. Um, I, we were going to say 28 toes, whatever you, that answer is. You are correct. 28 toes on a cat, 7 toes on each foot. You have the right question, and you have the new proud owner of a Matterhorn gift card and a Coffee Hound gift card. Congratulations. All right, hold on just one second. I'm going to get your information. Thank you for tuning in, guys. We've had a great weekend with you folks. We're going to be right back on the air, 730 next Saturday morning. Uh, so be sure to have a great day out there. We've got some more snow in the forecast for you. All righty. Uh